Hello, hi, namaste students. How are you all? I think by the God grace, you are all very fine. Okay. Concentrate now. Today in this session, I'd like to discuss about a, a particular properties or instead of saying properties, I'd like to derive some formulas which will be helpful in the inverse trigonometric function. Okay. I'd like to introduce the first formula that is sin inverse of x plus sin inverse of y is equal to sin inverse of x square root of 1 minus y square plus y square root of 1 minus x square. Got the point clearly? This formula, this is a particular formula you need to remember. I'd like to derive within one or two minutes, I'll derive it. Sin inverse of x equal to a sin inverse of y is equal to b then what about the uh, value of x x is nothing but a sin a y is nothing but a sin b okay na? then what about uh, sin square a plus cos square a exactly its value will be 1 that you already learned okay now what is cos square a can you say cos square a will be 1 minus sin square a okay cos a will be square root of 1 minus sin square a okay na? now cos a is equal to square root of 1 minus what is sin a it is x it will be x square got the point clearly is there any doubt in this one no you know then what about next term in the similar manner sin square b plus cos square b is equal to 1 what is cos square now cos square b will be 1 minus sin square b now what is cos b now cos b will be square root of 1 minus sin square b now what is cos b actually square root of 1 minus what is sin b sin b is nothing but y sin square means y square got the point clearly i think you understood this part now we already know that we know that what do we know concentrate what is sin of a plus b formula that you already learned in the trigonometric function? What is sin of a plus b? Sin of a plus b is sin a cos b plus cos a sin b. Okay, now nah? then what about next? Uh, let it be sin of a plus b as it is. Okay, now nah? what is the value of sin a? Check it. Sin a is nothing but a x what is cos b cos b is nothing but a square root of 1 minus y square plus what is cos a yes cos a is nothing but a square root of 1 minus x square here is the value okay now then what about uh, sin b sin b value is nothing but a y concentrate now let it be a plus b on the left hand side only i'd like to take this sine function on the right hand side it is sine inverse of x root of 1 minus y square plus y square root of 1 minus x square now okay what is the value of a now yes the value of a will be sine inverse of x okay sine inverse of x plus what is the value of b now sine inverse of y sine inverse of y what is the right part of the function here it is sine inverse of x root of 1 minus y square plus y square root of 1 minus x square this is a particular part this is a particular formula okay if it is minus if a sinus of x minus sinus of y then in the formula it will be minus okay i think you understood all the steps okay then what about the next one i'd like to take the next formula here what is the next one that is cos inverse of x plus cos inverse of y you need to remember this formula okay you need to remember sinus of x plus sinus of y is sinus of x under root of 1 minus x y square plus y under root of 1 minus x square okay some as well as difference formula you need to say okay then the next one will be cos inverse of x plus cos inverse of y formula okay it is cos inverse of x into y minus square root of 1 minus x square square root of 1 minus y square okay now then in a similar manner i need to derive this one cos inverse of x as a a 
cos inverse of y as a b now okay what is x value it is cos of a what is y value cos of b now okay what is cos square a plus sin square a yes its value will be 1 what is sin square a now sin square a will be 1 minus cos square a got the point clearly what is the sin a now sin a value is square root of 1 minus cos square a what is sin a now sin a value will be a square root of 1 minus what is cos a value cos a value is x cos square means x square okay now then the next will be it is cos square b plus sin square b is equal to 1 that we already know okay now sin square b left hand side as it is 1 cos square b on right hand side minus cos square of b okay got the point clearly what is sin b now sin b will be square root of 1 minus cos square b now sin b let it be as it is square root of 1 minus what is cos b cos b values will be y cos square will be y square okay i think you understood the basics here then the next part will be again we know the formula in the first view or a trigonometric part that is cos of a plus b what is cos of a plus b yes exactly that is cos a cos b minus sin a sin b okay now then it will be cos of a plus b is equal to what is cos a yes cos a will be x cos b will be y minus what is sin a sin a value will be square root of 1 minus x square sin b will be square root of 1 minus y square yes exactly it is similar to the last part okay let it be a plus b on left hand side only is equal to cos term on right hand side it will be cos inverse of cos inverse of what x into y minus square root of 1 minus x square square root of 1 minus y square okay now then what is the a value substitute it what is a value yes exactly cos inverse of a plus what is b value cos inverse of y is equal to what is the right part cos inverse of x into y minus square root of 1 minus x square square root of 1 minus y square okay this is a particular formula you need to remember if it is plus it will be minus if it is minus it will be plus okay i think you understood all the steps in this particular part okay now i'd like to derive one more formula okay that formula is you need to remember this part also this is similar to the last part okay i'd like to derive one more for the tan part i'd like to de derive one more formula okay now now concentrate here here it is tan inverse of a plus tan inverse of b is equal to tan inverse of okay uh, I, I use it in the last part x and y. I'll use the x and y only. Tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus xy. Got the point clearly? This is the formula. I'd like to derive it. It is a tan inverse of x is equal to a. Uh, tan inverse of y is equal to b now. What is x equal to? Tan inverse on right hand side. It is tan a. y is equal to tan of b okay in the first pu part or in trigonometry you learned tan of a plus b what is tan of a plus b can you say tan of a plus b is tan a plus tan b divided by 1 minus tan a into tan b okay we already know this particular formula okay now now what we need to derive the next whatever we know we need to substitute the values tan of a plus b is equal to what is tan a yes exactly it is x plus tan b it is y divided by 1 minus tan a is x tan b is y now i'd like to take tan on right hand side it will be whatever the left over term yes exactly a plus b is equal to tan on right hand side it will be tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus 
x y okay what's the value of tan a it will oh, what is the value of a tan inverse of x okay now plus what is the value of b tan inverse of y is equal to what is the right side formula right side formula is tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 on divided by 1 minus x y this is a particular formula okay you need to memorize it okay call it as a equation number one what about the another formula tan inverse of x plus tan inverse of y if it is a subtraction how the changes will be there it will be tan inverse of x plus y divided by 1 minus x y what are the changes i wrote the same plus will be minus minus will be plus that will be the changes whether you understood properly one more formula i'd like to write here that is uh, from equation number one from one replacing replacing y by x replacing y by x means wherever the value of y you will see there i need to substitute the value of x see here tan inverse of x plus y will be again tan inverse of x is equal to tan inverse of what it will be x plus y will be replaced by x divided by 1 minus x into x i'll write here okay what will be the formula here only i'd like to write okay what is tan inverse of x plus tan inverse of x it is 2 tan inverse of x is equal to tan inverse of x plus x 2x divided by 1 minus x into x x square whether you understood the part clearly okay